Hey, what's up, B? Operation iDroid here, and in this video, I'm going to be showing you how to effectively use YouTube's new cards feature. For those that don't know, the cards feature is basically an upgraded annotation. However, unlike annotations, the cards feature works on mobile and has a sleek user interface. The cards feature works like so. An eye will appear at the upper right hand corner. If it goes untouched, teaser text will appear. However, to view the cards, you'll actually have to click on the eye. YouTube allows you to add five cards. These cards can be anything from a video, a playlist, if you're a musician, an iTunes song, a Patreon support page, your website, and much more. The YouTube's card feature is an effective way to engage your audience and is pretty simple to use. With that being said, Let's head into the tutorial. Alright, YouTube Cards is available to all content creators if your account is in good standing. Unfortunately, my main account is not and I will be using my second channel to show you all how to do this. To get to the YouTube Cards feature, all you have to do is head to your creator studio, go to your video manager, and then select edit on the video you would like to add cards to. From here, you can find the card section coincidentally next to the annotation feature. Once you click on that, we can get to work on adding our cards. All right, adding cards is very simple, but first scroll to the point in the video where you would like the teaser text to appear. For example, on my second channel, I review episodic anime and I have a playlist for each review. So. Whenever I speak of that in the video, I would like to add the card in that section by simply selecting add card and then create for whatever it is that you want to add. In my case, I'm going to be adding a playlist. So I'm going to select create and here I'll have the option to have a video or I can click on playlist and select the playlist appropriate for what I'm speaking of and then select add. Now this will add the playlist to appear as a small teaser and then if the viewer clicks on it, he can click on that playlist. Now, you can also move the location of where the teaser text will appear by scrolling on the bottom. However, this is completely up to you and your channel. Now, the eye will always be at the top right of the screen. However, the viewer will have to be hovering over the screen to see it. But for the text to appear, that is where you place your card. So this is a very neat feature because this will happen no matter what. So you can place it in various spots in your video to engage the viewer and YouTube recommends that you space them out correctly so that viewers are always getting a reminder to check out the cards in the video. And that's as simple as it is. That's how you add a card. Now, like I mentioned, there's a tons of other things that you can do with cards. You can add merchandise. And there's a whole list of approved sites that YouTube has. You can add your website that's associated to your channel and so many other things. So I encourage you to experiment with these YouTube cards now that you know how to add them and use them to effectively engage with your audience and get them to do the things that you would like them to do. Anyways, thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, then please leave a like as it helps these tutorials out immensely. As well as if you have any questions, make sure to leave them in the comment section below and I will do my best to answer them as quickly as possible. And if you'd like to hit that subscribe button to be notified whenever I upload a video, that would be awesome as I make tutorials on, well, anything. So if you enjoyed this one, I'm sure you'll enjoy my other ones. Again, thanks for watching. Thanks for subscribing and welcome to the operation.